Hundreds of people are expected at the polls here in Anthony, New Mexico, as the city holds its first ever election since it was incorporated in January. The future of Anthony now lies with the people. It actually feels pretty good. It feels like we are going to have leadership now, and I'm glad that is, that's happening in my era. Alex Puldillo is among the registered voters who will turn out to elect the city's first municipal judge, the first four board of trustees, and Anthony's first mayor. Well, I want more than just a casino. I want streets, lights, I want jobs, I want youth groups and stuff. Peggy Scott and Ann Frances Hernandez are running against each other for a municipal judge. There are 10 candidates in the race for trustee and four candidates in the race for mayor. Mayoral candidate Ramon Juarez is a retired businessman and says a casino along with retail giant Walmart can help improve the local economy. I want to see it uh, like Anthony, Texas. I want us to be to have a lot of businesses here. I like to see people come come to our to our city. And, and shop here, come to our city and visit us. Sergi Copado says as mayor, he would like to improve Anthony's infrastructure, security and its transportation issues. What I want to do is bring a shuttle bus service that with, uh, offers cheap transportation to the major cities because most people work 20 miles away or, or further. So I want to bring a shuttle service for those who cannot afford a car or their own transportation so we can take them to, uh, also to their places of work and also their uh, in-city in uh, transportation as well. Ramon Gonzalez was born and raised in Anthony. He's running for mayor because he already knows about the problems the city faces. Gonzalez says to grow, the city needs to be united. Working together, uh, hopefully to find the, uh, the things where we need is basically grants. Grants for the people where we can you know, implement them into our, into our society, especially now that we're a city. Carlos Romero is the fourth candidate for mayor and was involved in helping Anthony become an incorporated city. Romero says he wants to help local businesses grow. Locally, it's uh, real small, it's uh, family businesses, and we need to uh, uh, better our economy by uh, uh, strengthening our, our businesses, our small businesses, uh, to the point to where we'll be able to, to compete to, uh, in regards to other areas like Anthony, Texas, for example. There are only 2,000 registered voters, so there's a big push to get most, if not all of them, to the polls on Election Day. For KRWG, I'm Carlos Correa.